Yo, what is up, YouTube? It's your boy, Grio, Gyro, whatever you want to call me, man. And the gameplay might be a little laggy here. I'm trying to actually fix the gameplay. I don't know what happened to my Elgato while recording this, but it was pretty straight. As you see me dotting my mans up. So look, man, I'm going to be showing y'all boys how to rep up fast because I'm still seeing y'all All-Star 2, All-Star 1. I'm like, yo, what is up with you, bro? Like, why are you honestly still an All-Star 1? Weren't you blowing up in 2K20? Why are you an All-Star 1, man? I don't even know why I'm a Superstar 1. I should be a Superstar 2. But I took a couple breaks. I, I, I took my time because I know I'm doing my job. I'm grinding. And you see me getting that 360. Now I'm saying, man. So the gameplay might be life might look a little speed up or, or slow down because I had to adjust it. So do you guys can actually see what's actually happening in actually fast paced motion? So look, man. So how to wrap up fast this year? You want to go to 3v3 Pro M. And the thing about going to 3v3 Pro M, you don't just go in there, right? You gotta actually get a squad, a, 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 some guys you know, some guys that you can run with consistently, knowing that you guys won't pause after a loss, won't pause after going to eat every single 15 minutes because y'all are fat. It's big greens in, in the chat, man. So look, man. So you guys want to find a, a right squad that you can play with, you can run a lot of games with in a row and not non-stop, okay, right? Because after every game is over, you guys are going to have to press X immediately, right? So you can get as many games as possible in the least amount of time, so that lets, lets you uh, rep up faster, man. So it's just like that simple, that easy, man. So I recommend you guys get a good squad that you guys like. I recommend you guys play a uh, point guard, which is me, and a lock sharp and or or sharpshooter and then a glass lock to finish it all off if you like to do iso this year i recommend you guys use a lock sharp and then a glass clean lockdown that can shoot as well so you guys can actually compete against others not that hard um i mean i do got a comp gameplay a decent comp gameplay ain't nobody comp against me because i'm gonna run everybody for their dollars man I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna actually do i'm gonna do mine i'm gonna do my job man as y'all see man i'm just trying to uh, talk over this gameplay so i try, try, try to tell y'all boys how to get some dang rep here man so i want to ask you guys a question man are you guys actually liking 2k20 do y'all like it do y'all hate it i don't know what the vibe is but i i, I kind of like it this year i have been getting mad a lot this year from getting sold man because shout out to lockdown wn because he's the biggest sellout that i play with but i still play with him man because i believe he got some potential i believe he can be better so i'm actually gonna play with him as you see man getting them white lights break easy but that's straight, man. I'm still a guy, y'all. I still, I still use the same exact jump shot from before, so you guys don't have to ask me if I use the same exact jump shot because I most definitely do, man. So right up here, man, we just playing some bots right here. You can see the score is two to fourteen, and we are blowing these guys out, man. We're not even playing with him as he makes that weak contested shot. I don't know why, but the skill gap is a little low this year. I don't like how bums can make actual bad shots because that's the only shots that bums take. Usually good players don't take those bad shots, so the fact that they give them to the bums means that's a less of a skill gap because the bums can make them because we never shoot those, and when we do shoot them, they're broken, but when the bots shoot them, they want to go in. So, yeah, they do need to fix something like that. As you see me getting the big green lights, now I'm saying. Big reds in the chat, now I'm saying. Big t big Grio takeover when that Grio badge on, something going wrong. Shout out to my man, Pugatti, man. At, but I'm just trying to wrap up here, and look, so... If you guys are a center, a lock sharp, or whatever, I don't play with other guards. But look, you want to make sure your guard can dribble, man. You want to make sure your guard has to run. Your guard has to run the team this year. I don't care about what the center says. I don't care about what the, what the shooter says. I run the team, man. I have to do legit everything for us to win. Okay, the center, the center, yeah, it's, he's important. The the shooter, he's not that important. But the shooter has to play his defense, his side of the story, man. But, I mean, I'm tired of it, man. I'm tired of playing guard, man, because I got to do everything for my team. I got to worry about every sh everybody shooting, everybody doing their job. As you see, that man was getting tossed in a circle. He didn't know what to do, man. He did not know what to do right there. He was questioning life at that point of the time. I had to say the video clip because that was so, so dirty what I had did to him, man. So, look. If you're not a guard, man, please do not come talking to me in any disrespectful kind of way because, I mean, I honestly don't care, man. And as you see, we made these guys quit, and it was only 4-10. to 10. They had no hope. They knew we were going to blow them out. So, they made those guys quit in that game right there. And then, this is the game for comp right here. As you see, we're playing a pro silver team. They were actually pretty decent. I'm not going to hate. They were pretty good. We were 6-9 and at the time. Right now, we're like 20-1 and right now. So, I'm not, not too worried about it. We're doing our little thing. We're not trying to lose. We're trying to go perfect. You know what I'm saying, man? So, on the other side of the story, 
guard's most important. So if you guys run this lineup, you want to have a good guard, okay? There's not that many good guards out here because I'll be clamping all the guards up. Like, I don't really care. Like, as y'all finna see, man, this guard thinks he's good. I'm finna... Oh, my God. They had a lead up, they had a lead on us at the start, and then I started catching on what to do and stuff like that. So they had a, they had a pretty decent lead at the start. So I, I didn't really like that lead, so I had to do my little thing, man. As you see, I am moving a little slow in here. I actually need to fix that, which I'm going to fix it while I'm talking over here. But look, so if you guys have a good guard, make sure he knows how to do certain moves. The certain moves that he knows that he needs to know how to do is the boot box. Which I'm going to be dropping a video on later uh, in the future. Uh, probably in the next video I drop is how to do the boot bop. I do the boot bop a lot. And the, the name is funny. I, 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 call, I call the name. Well, shout out to my man Justin being Hoover because he called it the boot bop. Uh, it was, it's a pretty cold name. I'm going to drop the video on the boot bop. I know y'all boys want the boot bop. I keep saying boot bop, but I don't care. The boot bop is cold. You can't guard the boot bop in this, this year, man. So I'm speeding up these video clips right now so you guys can actually get the uh, footage correctly. And, I mean, as you see me dot my man snag right there. So look, y'all. Uh, this year, defense is really bad this year. So all you guys have to do is just run into your defender. As you see, you know, I'm going to be playing lockdown defense earlier in the year. And as my center is not picking up, I don't know why he's not picking up. It gets me heated. He needs to be picking up for me, right? He needs to be helping me out, man. Cause I don't be, I don't be getting no help out here. So since my center wouldn't pick up, green, big greens in the chat, man. So since my center wouldn't pick up, I had to do my dirty work. I was like, yo, I'm tired of this. I'm pressing him. I'm pressing him, man. So he don't know what to do right there. I'm playing off defense. Center picks up that first time, and then I, we let the center score the ball. And then this is, this was the time where we was like, man, we ain't putting up with this, man. It's clamp time. It's clamp time. So I'm doing my little thing. I turn on the Grio badge, even though the Grio badge ain't on yet. It's on for me. It's on for me. They try to foul me, then they got out of we got out of bounds that possession. So I'm clapping the man up. I'm tired of the guard. I'm like, yo, I'm not putting up with this. Look, clamp, brick. We actually played these guys twice and did my man Snag. Snag wasn't feeling good right at then, so he wasn't getting no boards. I don't know why he wasn't getting no boards. He was making me mad. So, but Snag's still my best center out. I still love him. So that's my guy Snag We're out here, man. So I'm just doing my little thing. I'm trying to cook up. I'm trying to sauce him. And Snag gets that big body right there. And then they they rip the ball out of bounds once again. Pass my man locked down. He finally didn't sell me this time. He made the three, man. So clamp badge is activated clamp is activated y'all y'all look how i play this defense this is how y'all want to play guards you see y'all want to not let them breathe man look keep following them keep running after them i'm like yo i'm tired of this i'm not putting up with this no more look i'm clamping you i'm clamping you what is he gonna do he don't know what to do look at that out about he don't even know what to do he can't move his his he got he got glue on his shoes man he can't move he can't move man so i'm telling snag to give me the ball i don't know what he's doing right now uh, he was really BSing uh, a couple games on the street, man. He was BSing. But he finally got back. And then Big Greens, easy. Uh, he finally got back into his game, during the game. Now he's snagging on everybody because his name is Snagatron, man. Shout out to him. Big shout out to him, man. Y'all go mess with his channel, man. His, his name is Snagatron, just like his PSN on here. Y'all go y'all go mess with his channel, man. Yeah, he, he, really, he really cold at this stuff, man. Y'all go show him some love, man. So I mean I'm just doing my little thing. I'm just trying I'm just I'm trying to get the game over with because we're playing a little decent comp. So I give my give my man snack. We're not playing around with no bots, man. We're not playing around with bots. None of these years, man. We gonna do our job and we gonna finesse with it. We we, we gonna do our job. So you ain't gotta worry about what I do. You just know I'm gonna win, okay? I'm not gonna lose like that. But when I do lose, I do yell. Okay, I'm gonna lose my voice. I might not sound like my regular self because I lost my voice from yelling that lockdown because he sold me on the twos game, man. I I don't know why. But I need to stop yelling. If you guys went into my streams, y'all would actually be seeing me yell, okay? If y'all want a live reaction of me yelling, which I'm not going to post on my channel, y'all can just go to my streams because I, I yell, okay? When I yell, it's the end of the day, man. Just when I yell, it's the end of the day. Nobody even wants, talk, wants to even tolerate me because I just be yelling because I don't care what you got to say. You sold me. You deserve to be yelled at, man. You It doesn't... This game is just not that hard this year. As you see, man, I'm clapping him up. He don't even know what to do right at the moment, man. He's just like, yo, forget life right now. Where are you getting beat? I don't know what to do. Y'all should see in the second game, man. I made that man shoot three for 14. He couldn't move. He couldn't move. Now I play I play every guard with this kind of defense every single time, man. Because 3v3 Pro-Am, you're going you're gonna to go against some comp. You're not going to go against bots all the time like you do in park. 3v3 Pro-Am, you're going to go against some comp. And if you go against us, say goodbye. Just quit the game. Give my rep quicker, man. Just say goodbye if you go against us. The only people that beat us are bots, 
or like like the bots bots like the rookie threes that be snagging on snagging time no nah, but look the rookie threes that be getting the bs that game that's that's who be beating us and then also the uh the really the sweats okay the sweats in this game they beat us too but they, they don't beat us that that often okay they, they beat us sometimes but they don't beat us that often so i mean i can tolerate the sweats because i know uh, i know how they play i know how i play so i can really clamp them up if i need to you see me i'm trying to give it the snag i, I didn't really get it to snag i was just trying to do my little thing right here because so i was just trying to reset the play it wasn't too hard man but like i'm doing a boot bop on him he don't know what to do i'm telling him, like guard me man guard me man so i don't know what to do i just do a floater break right there my guy snag gets a rebound over his takeover he don't care about his takeover at all i'm just trying to finish up this game just get the game over with so i'm gonna do my quick reverse layup make it okay man i thought i missed actually man but that's the video for y'all boys peace out y'all it's your boy grill guy or whatever you want to call me man i'm a mighty game coach that's the best method i got for y'all boys good bye